Yes guys, what's going on? Phil Dyer here with Chapman Guitars and I'm here today to look at the ML3 Pro Modern Semi Hollow. You're probably familiar with the ML3 Pro at the moment, but this is slightly different. This is a Semi Hollow. We've got two Semi Hollows. We've got the traditional and the modern. The traditional has P90s and the modern has humbuckers. I'll run through the specs on this for you now. Starting from the top, this has got the angled heritage headstock. It's also got the hip shot open gear lock and tuners. It's got a tusk nut, it's 25 and a half inch scale length. It's a roasted maple neck with 24 jumbo stainless steel frets. Glow in the dark side dots and a pale infinity inlay at the 12th fret. The body is mahogany and it has a flame maple veneer top. As for the hardware, we've got a Chapman string through hardtail bridge with brass saddles. This guitar is a neck through construction also, which you can see on the close-ups. It also has a tone and a volume pot with a five-way blade. The two humbuckers, the five-way blade allows you to go for bridge, a bridge split, both of the inner coils, a neck split and the full neck humbucker. The pickups themselves, and I hope I'm saying this right, Rob, please correct me if I'm not, are Chapman Madrigal humbuckers. So we've got a Madrigal humbucker in the bridge and a Madrigal humbucker in the neck. So initially when I was thinking of semi-hollows, I thought that these guitars would be brilliant for blues rock, maybe some kind of poppy styles, but what I didn't realise is this guitar is absolutely phenomenal for playing heavy metal on. So I tuned this guitar down to drop C, which you can hear in the intro, and ran through some tracks and it absolutely killed it. I was really surprised. The clarity that you get and the sustain is unbelievable, so I was really surprised. When I was running through the pickup selection on this guitar, I kind of forgot what pickups I was supposed to be running through. So I ended up just having so much fun with it and jamming on like a bluesy riff that I had. So I just kept kept running with it and I think the end result speaks for itself because the range of sounds, but well, you can really hear it. In the video, uh, the intro track is down to drop C and the pickup demonstration is in D standard and I think the guitar really sings tuned down. I only put some heavier strings on it just to give it a bit more tension. This comes out the box with a set of 10 to 42 any ball strings. I put some 11 to 52s on just for a bit more tension while it's tuned down but i think it sounds absolutely fantastic as you can hear in the demo <laughs> Anyway, I've been Phil Dyer. Thanks for watching this demonstration of the ML3 Pro Modern Semi Hollow.